Hello guys, today I'd like to show you if you got any AMD older graphic cards and got the overheat problem and clean and change the thermal paste. Doesn't help? I can help you with this little tweak. I'll show you an example on HD7850. I've got a gigabyte overclock edition. It's standard clock is 975 megahertz and uh, power for this car on this megahertz is 1210 which is so high for this card and the way you can tweet this BIOS is actually software which is called VBE7 it's really easy software you can just open the BIOS you wanna tweet like this one and you can just change any core clock from the step 1, step 2 and step 3 for this card because overheat over 100 Celsius I tweak down the core 3 to 900 and put the power down from 1210 to 1025 sorry 1025 and also DVD power over I tweak down to just 100 which means you can use the power supply which got a less wattage and less power ampere consume on his 12 wattage rail hopefully it will be help you and you can use the car even on the weakest power supply but main point is take the power down as I already do this on this stock you can see I changed the 900 here from clock free from 900 from 975 to 900 and VDC to 1025 you can change this from 800 to 1225 which this card original, originally got I think 1210 and we just you can see it's nearly on max nearly killed this card but yeah guys the card is working and because I put the 900 it's, you can see the official version is got a 800 megahertz on the car which means this car is still slightly overclocked still running very well and give it another shot another couple of months life for someone yeah why not it is easy easy to use once you once you done your edit your bios you just need to click save after that, download the Ativin Flash, whatever version you want. You just remember, always you need to open as administrator. Once you open this Ativ Flash, you just load the image with the BIOS you just tweak, like this, and just click on program and wait till it's finished. Reboot PC and all is done. That is permanent overclock or downclock you can actually overclock on this way as well which is more safe and more easy as doing some different program like MSI Afterburn or uh, Etty software straight away yeah I like this way I always do on this way because it's more easy and more safe I think only you must be sure using the right and correct BIOS and best way to tweet the BIOS is if you, if you download GPU Z you got the button here just give you save your BIOS and it's best way just tweak the BIOS which is original in the car start slowly change this slowly down or slowly up depends which way you wanna go to be sure you're not overclock if you make a mistake you can still roll back the old one but if you're doing slowly first issue will be see is actually like artifact and stuff like this and you know you're doing so much if you're going down so much like not putting enough power to your chip PC will be freeze but remember there is still a way to flash the BIOS back even if you need to use DOS where car doesn't use any more power and doesn't need the power as Windows desktop even which there is still a way okay I hope you like this video subscribe for more and any questions just write comment below stay tuned and click subscribe guys and smash that bell button. Thanks.